Welcome back everyone, this is Sean Thomas and we're looking at Ark Survival Vol Dossiers. Alright, so this is a dossier of a critter that has not yet released. This is the Yuri Terid. Uh, Yuri Terid is going to be non-tameable. It's going to be an underwater uh, critter, pretty deep in the water. And it's going to drop us chitin, pearls, and I guess there's some black pearls, as you can see in the bottom left of the screen. There's some three white pearls, so they'll be common, and then the black pearl will be a, an uncommon item. So, uh, from what it mentions later on, it'll, it's uh, used for mysterious technologies. So this might be uh, the new tech tier, the alien tier that has not yet released. All right, so let's take a look at the dossier and uh, glean as much as we can from this. So in the wild, they're found only in the deepest, deepest depths of the waters around the island, Euro Turids are dangerous and adaptable anthropods is likely to hunt as they are to scavenge. A Euroterid rarely has difficulty finding food to keep itself nourished even at the bottom of the ocean. A Euroterid's threat does, not, does come not directly from its raw strength, instead it combines a hard defensive exoskeleton with debilitating poison to, to powerful effect. The sting of a Euroterid increases torpor while reducing stamina, quickly rendering its opponents unable to defend itself. Domesticated while Euroterids are not intelligent enough to be tamed, this doesn't mean they are without utility for tribes. They are a wonderful source of chitin, and their digestive tract often contains silica pearls. They sometimes even have ingested incredibly rare black pearls used for manufacturing mysterious technologies, making them among the most valuable creatures on the island. Alright, so picture yourself uh, once this releases either with a scuba tank or a diplocalis attached to your mouth, uh, another non-released yet tame. Uh, you might be riding a shark or one of the, uh, the other underwater leviathans as you scavenge these uh, guys off the bottom. Uh, you're going to want to make sure that you have stem berries likely to feed your uh, shark or whatever you're using. And um, yeah, so they're going to have pearls, they're going to have chitin, likely uh, the black pearls for the new tech. While you're down there you'll likely be collecting oil, so you can probably get quite a few different resources that you need for crafting for your tribe. These guys are said to be at the very bottom, so you're likely not going down there without some kind of uh, breathing support. I imagine you could do it with just a uh, Lazarus Chatter, uh, but you generally can only be underwater for about five minutes with that, so it's going to be quite tedious to go down and swim around just to, to collect a little bit and then come back up. Uh, well. Uh, also make sure you got plenty of stimulants for yourself if you're going just by yourself I strongly dis uh, <laughs> do not recommend doing that you're gonna want something pretty big that's not gonna get knocked out maybe a couple uh, safer to go with a, a pair or more of uh, whatever you're using sharks and whatnot I do not recommend going down there with an icky the dolphin um, so looking forward to the new tech tree uh, with the the alien tech I believe that's what these black pearls are gonna be used for Hope this has been helpful to you. Look forward to the release of the Year Terrid. Mash that like button. Please subscribe. It's free to do so. It helps me out, and you'll be notified about new content that's released. All right. I appreciate you watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.